Hello and welcome to this channel where today we're going to be predicting who will win VCT Champions. I'm just going to say this from the start, this is my thoughts and opinions, so you're not going to agree, so don't fucking comment like last time. But basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down through the groups and just see what I'm going to say. So we're going to start off with Group A, and the first matchup is Paper X versus Crew. Now Crew did have an unbelievable run through LCQ after coming dead last in America's League, but somehow winning every single game in lcq so this is bonus points for crew but unfortunately i feel like paper x would still beat them i think at least one or two maps will be close but i feel like paper x will definitely win now next one up is edg versus giants we saw edg last time during masters tokyo and i feel like i don't know why but I'm gonna have to give it to EDG. Yes, Giants did go for the LCQ stage, beating Na'Vi 3-0, which is an incredible in any way. So I feel like this one could go either way. It could go EDG, it could go Giants, but honestly, I feel like if Ascent is played, I feel like EDG will win. And that is what I think is going to happen. Now, next matchup is Crew versus Giants. Both winning LCQ, but I feel like in recent form, like LCQ form, I feel like both teams could also be either or. But I feel like Crew will just get the advantage here. Like Giants could beat Crew, but I feel like Crew, with their recent form in LCQ, will win. Now Paper X versus EDG, we saw it last time during Masters where Paper X did beat EDG 2-1. So for that reason, I feel like Paper X would just win again. But now we come to the decider. Now here. I'm going to have to give it to EDG. Yes, Crew has obviously, and I mentioned again, went through that incredible run. But I feel like that luck will eventually die out for them. And I think EDG will win. Now, we go on to Group B. Now, first off the bat is Evil Geniuses versus FPX. Now, I'm just going to say it. I don't really watch Pacific. I mainly watch Americas and EMEA. So... FPX and T1 I have obviously heard of before, but given the run during Tokyo, I'm going to have to give this to EG just based off current form. I feel like EG will definitely have an edge over FPX. Uh, this one could go either way, but I, I still believe EG will win 2-0 somehow. Now, the interesting matchup. Foot B T1. Now... I'm not gonna lie, this is just the EMEA in me just screaming to go put foot through. And considering they qualified for champions before Na'Vi did, which is absolutely insane to me because in my head Na'Vi's second team in EU, but apparently Liquid has that now. So I still believe foot will win this game. Now for FPX versus T1. I'm not gonna lie, this, this game I won't really know what the fuck to put. But I believe T1 will just go through. I'm not sure on FPX's roster. I don't know how they play. So it's going to be another one of these. Yeah, we'll do your research comments. But honestly, uh, no. You're watching. Get a better video. Skill issue. And for that reason, Evil Genius is going to go through. And Foot's going to go through. It's just as simple as that. Now, next group has the likes of Fnatic and NRG. Now, straight off the bat, I believe Fnatic will continue on their win streak. So Fnatic will be Zeta. Zeta, a, a decent team, but unfortunately for Zeta, they will have to go down into the, the elimination bracket. Now, same with this one. No clue who the fuck Billy Billy Gaming is. But obviously, I know of their website and all that fucking shit. I believe in energy supremacy, so. I mean, to be fair, in my opinion, this whole group is just an absolute no-brainer for me. Like, Fnatic energy could go either way, but I just feel like Fnatic will just go through. That puts Zeta versus Billy Billy, which I believe Zeta will win, and I believe energy will also go through. Now, we go on to the final group. EU versus EU. Liquid versus Na'Vi. Now, given current form, Liquid would demolish this any day. Second best team in EU, Na'Vi 
be, being its fourth. But currently speaking, I feel like Liquid would definitely have a hold over Na'Vi. I believe this one could end up being a 2-1. Next game, DRX versus Loud. Now, both times these teams have faced off, Loud has won both of them, being 2-0 in Champions last year and a 3-2 in Sao Paulo. But obviously, we saw that they didn't win because Fnatic did. But something tells me that DRX will somehow pull something out of their ass crack and win. But honestly, I feel like it's going to be another close game. And I believe Loud will just about have the edge on DRX. Now, next matchup is Na'Vi versus DRX. Where Na'Vi, at this point, don't look as strong. But DRX also a decent team. I believe this one would end up being a 2-1. I don't know exactly who it's going to go to. So we're going to flip a coin. Let's just say... Heads is Na'Vi, and Tails is DRX. And looks like Na'Vi wins. That wasn't edited, so you can see Na'Vi is going through. Now, Liquid versus Loud. Now, we have seen Liquid and Loud play before, but this was years ago with their old rosters, with Pancada and, and Sassy obviously being picked up by Sentinels. And obviously, the likes of Stroman and Avera going to Carmine Core, and Link going to LPB, which is... No longer a thing. But I believe due to the rosters of Liquid having Nats, Redgar, and Loud's current form, I, I believe Liquid will fully go on to win both of their games and go through. Now Loud versus Na'Vi, both of these teams have looked fairly shocking at the minute, with Loud not going through Masters Tokyo that much. Same with Na'Vi, Na'Vi going through LCQ, getting into the finals, losing it, but they're still here because of Fnatic. So just like before, this one could go either way now this one i believe we'll have to go to another flipper coin so you know heads for loud tails for narvi so we're gonna do it once again and we're just waiting 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 and somehow Na'Vi goes through again. Anyways, I hope you appreciated the video. If you did like, I, I don't care what you do. You can dislike the video for all I care. Uh, sub to the channel if you want more of these predicting BCT videos. I might also do like next year's EMEA League, America's League and Pacific League just for the fun. But anyways, I will catch you all in the next video. Goodbye.